So the American Cancer Society for the past several decades put out um, a, a fairly lengthy manuscript that lists things about diet and lifestyle that people can do to help prevent various types of cancers. In the world of colorectal cancer, the things that we know most consistently can impact one's risk is avoidance of obesity, so maintaining a healthy weight, um, increasing levels of physical activity, so having an active lifestyle, and certain dietary things, particularly minimizing of red meat and processed meats are the most prominent ones. There are some others that still really do need increasing research like vitamin D, um, certain other dietary factors, but those are sort of the latest updates from the American Cancer Society, particularly to colorectal cancer, and then there's some updates on other cancers as well. And really, until, until about 10 years ago, there was little known if any of these factors affect people who already had disease. And that's really in the past 10 years, we're starting to develop studies and get results of those studies looking at certain factors that may impact one's risk of either recurrence or overall survival uh, from colorectal cancer. So specifically what we've been able to look at is various studies looking at levels of physical activity patients have engaged in either during their treatment or particularly after their treatment and recurrences from colorectal cancer and the people who are more physically active seem to have a lower risk of recurrence. We've also looked at certain dietary factors and the one we've studied the most is what's called a western pattern diet which is characterized by a higher level of red meat, processed meat, sugary desserts, refined grains, and those who have the highest levels of those compared to lower levels relatively seem to have a lower risk or have a higher risk of recurrence with a higher level of Western pattern diets. We've looked at level of obesity and as opposed to certain other cancers where some modest level of obesity seems to increase your risk of recurrence, at least in colorectal cancer survivors, it's really a BMI greater than 35 kilograms per meter squared that seems to have some in relative increased risk of recurrence. We've also tried to look at change of weight, and at least in the one study we've been able to do so far on that subject, change of weight doesn't seem to impact one's risk of in recurrence or survival. However, a healthy weight is still important for other diseases that colorectal cancer survivors can have later in life.